Today is the day I got my Erin Condren order for 2018. Let's open this bad boy up. Got my handy dandy scissors and I haven't even sliced the side open yet. Ooh, I've got my tripod on full extension right now and I feel like it's gonna just fall over because I needed to get it so far away from the actual tripod legs because this box is just ginormous. All right, let's open this sucker up. Dun, 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 dun. Ooh, hold on, I gotta take the packing slip out. I don't need any more stalkers. All right, let me turn you around a little bit. Oh, almost hit that camera. There we go. All right, so there is, ooh, pretty watercolor. Being kind never goes out of style. Cute little postcard. That's cute. And then there's a little enjoy sticker with the same watercolor. All right, so I got a lot of things. And yes, I will be doing a pen test, but today is gonna be just an unboxing for you guys. So I got a really big box because I got a couple of different planners, okay? And yes, I will also be doing a walkthrough of both of the planners on my channel. They're gonna be two separate videos because they're two separate like layouts and stuff. So this is gonna be my main planner for next year. I tend to really enjoy the 12 month planner from January 1 to December 31. So I'm not gonna even start using this until January 1. But of course I had to buy it on launch day because you know, because um, this has like the little film that's removable, so. Yeah, I got the painted petals and I did not get any personalization because I don't know, I just didn't. I didn't know what I wanted to order, honestly. I wasn't really sure. And I was like, well, this is like what's happening this year, so let's just go for it. Um, all right, so I'll just walk through it really, really quickly, and then we'll get into the rest of the goodies in the box because, like I said, I'm gonna do a totally dedicated video on this actual planner and my other planner too. So you get the little pouch with all the accoutrements in there, and then you got the pretty vellum page. To me, this kind of looks like Dalmatian spots. I don't know. So I decided to go with the colorful this year and I will walk through like the differences in that other video. Wow, this paper does feel different. I know a lot of people have been talking about the paper quality and like how thick it feels and how like, oh, this is sad. It's all like jacked in the corner there. Oh well, that's fine. That's fine, nothing to be upset about. I like how the thankful thought is missing. You just like, there's a little box. I like, I like that a lot. Um, yeah, so anyway, this is my new planner for this year. And I, I understand what people are talking about with the paper. It does feel a lot better, which is good. For some reason, I felt like it was gonna be like more smooth. I do like a little bit of grit to it though too. I'm gonna have to pen test it for you guys. But anyway, I got the colorful and I got the 12 month. I know that there are options now where you can get a 12 month from July to June, which I think is a nice option, especially if you have kids in school and that's kind of like how your brain works for the year. But since I don't have any kids in school, my brain works from January to December. So yeah, and then there's a bunch of, oh, I'm really excited to look at these. Check these out. These are the new um, sticker pages, which are awesome because I will totally use these. I'll use these too because I use these on a, my normal daily basis at work. Um, but yeah, and then there's a perpetual calendar. Yeah, there's always a perpetual calendar. I never use these, but whatever. I always end up throwing them in a, a rack or something. And then that is the planner. So this is my new planner. I'm very excited about it. So before I get started on the other things, I wanna show you guys my other planner. Um, this is gonna be my YouTube planner for 2018. And I know I've kind of talked about my other YouTube planner. I've never really like shown it, but I will at some point on my channel, probably towards more towards like the end of the year because I wanna like fill it out and like show you what I'm doing. But essentially I'm gonna do like the same thing in this planner but I got a really different planner, you guys. So it's still a colorful, because I thought, why not? And then still has the same pouch and whatnot, and I will go through this in a video as well. I got a vertical layout. Ta-da! I got a vertical. Okay, so I've been like 
kind of obsessively stalking Jennifer Crowder. I will put her Instagram below. You guys should all check her out. I have been so enjoying her going back to a vertical that I have been wanting to go back to a vertical as well. But I knew in my normal daily life, I just couldn't do it. I couldn't justify doing it because the headers make me upset and whatever. Like I just can't do it in my normal life. However, in my YouTube life, I think I could, because I put in like when I edit, I put in when I film. I, you know, I don't use this as much because a lot of times I'm just doing stuff on the weekends or like editing on like a certain night or whatever. So I can justify it in here. So yeah, I am very, very excited to try this out again and see how I like it but I am excited and kind of nervous <laughs> to go back this way. But again, like I said, it's gonna be for YouTube. Um, it has the same stuff in the back too, but again, I'll end up doing a walkthrough video on the vertical. Oh, I'm so excited. So here is all of the other things. Let me pull this stuff out and get this big box out of the way and then we'll go into all of the things. All right, so the first thing is this designer paper tape. Let's take a look. I've been hearing things about it. Ooh, it's like interesting. All right, hold on, hold on. It's like taped down with a piece of clear tape. All right, let's put a piece of washi in here. I wanna put it like right here. How's that? All right, let's zoom you guys in because I wanna kind of like test this sucker out. All right, so here is the tape and it's called paper tape because it is like, it's like paper, it's not, like that thin washi, it's actually kind of substantial. So I don't even know if this will cut properly like I would a regular washi. Let's test it out and see. And I was honestly, I was gonna get like all three of these because I was like, oh, I wanna check out all the new washies, but I wanted to test out the quality first because, you know, sometimes you end up buying something and you're like, oh, why did I do that? Ooh, this is satisfying. Okay, so it does, fray a little bit at the end. Hold on, let's, let me zoom you all in. You can see up close and personal. Let's see if you guys can see. Can you see the fray? I hope you can see the frayed edge. It's slightly frayed, but honestly, for as thick as it is, I don't really mind that. I mean, honestly, you could obviously use a scissors, but that's not too bad. I thought it wouldn't even cut at all to be completely honest but yeah I like this I think this is a cool thing I might get some more but I wanted to test out the you know one of them first just to see I have had um, Aaron Condren washi in the past and to be honest it was not my favorite um, just because it just it didn't come off the roll really well and it just seemed like it wasn't very well made I don't know I hate to like bash things whoa sorry I hate to like bash things but it's true and that's why I like literally never used it. So I don't know, now you know. But yeah, I'm excited. I think that looks nice. And it's like, it's like glossy. So you can't, it's not matte. I mean, you could still put stickers over it, but I wouldn't like write anything on it unless it was like with a permanent marker. But anyway, all right, let's get back into other things. All right, here is the Planny Pack. Oh, this is so cool. Um, I got the one in linen, which has a silver band on the back. Um, there was the the black, and then, what's the, oh, and I had, there's the rose gold, and wasn't there like the turquoise too? I don't know, maybe there wasn't a turquoise. I don't know. I just thought this one looked nice, and it was, you know, pretty clean looking, and I don't mind the silver and it's like really nicely lined on the inside. I really like that. I like that, okay, we're just gonna use this as an example. You can just plop it over your cover or over the whole entire book too, but that would probably be a little bit tight. And then you can put in like stickers, you can put in washi, you can put in pencils and pens and just whatever you want to inside of there. You could even put like invitations or something like that and it just like, goes with you, you know, like you don't have to worry about it and it's just right there. And it's not another like loose thing to hold on to. Um, 
it's just like a really big planner band with a pocket, which is kind of neat. So I really like that. I think that's super cool. All right, this was one of the free gifts that you got for ordering on launch day. And I think it was like while supplies last or whatever, but it showed up like in your basket. So yeah, this was really cool. It's rose gold, um, not my fave, but I understand the appeal. I get it, it's just not my favorite, but I'll use it anyway because Let's face it, anything Erin Condren makes, I will probably use at some point in my life. And I also got these. Um, these are the sticky notes. These are the new ones for this year. Um, I just wanted to see them and see the color. Um, I'm not gonna pull them out of the package because they're just, they're just sticky notes, you guys. Like, I'm not super incredibly <laughs> worried about it. So, yeah, but I am excited about these, and I, I do like this painted petals. I like it better in the colorful. I don't know about the neutral. It looks like a Dalmatian to me, so. It's just not my fave. I also got this designer sticker book, the edition three. So this is the new one for this season. You can walk through this real quick as well. All right, so it's all rose gold, my favorite. And it's all watercolored on the inside, which is very pretty. So yeah, this is all gold foil on this page silver foil on this page and rose gold but i do like how much more functional some of these sheets are i mean like this page it's like all quotes for the most part i mean you can put some things in there and like right here but you know i'm not a huge fan of these like they're cute don't get me wrong but like i just don't have that space in my planner nor does it like usually pertain to my life so I like how, you know, functional some of these things are. So, I don't know. Or I don't mind like little things like this, but I don't know, those big ones are just kind of like in your face. You know what I'm saying? Pretty watercolors. I like the watercolors. I love the happy birthdays. Those are cute. Um, so some gift tags, which are always nice to have, which by the way, like I need to start putting these on gifts, even though I don't give a lot of gifts. I need, maybe I need to start giving more gifts. I don't know. But um, I never really give a lot of things, but it's mostly like gift cards and cash because it's always like weddings and stuff. I don't know. I never know what to buy. I just go off the registry and then if I can't find anything that is like in a box and easy to wrap, I just give cash because cash is great. Um, all right, so here is some just like little flags and it has like little foil sayings on it. These are really cute. I really, really like these little flags. Those are nice. And then some washi strips. I love a good washi strip. Ooh, and we got some silver washi strips. We got some icons and that is it for the Designer Sticker Book Classic Collection 3. Very cute, I really like those. I also got a whole bunch of these. These are the Plan For It pouch. I got it in the mid-century circle version. I am doing an organizational project with these. So this is like a to be determined kind of a situation. I'm not going to tell you too much about it. I've mentioned an organizational project on my videos before. If you can figure it out, let me know in the comments. Haha. -ha. Um, also, I got a carry all clutch. I got these like cute little water droplet rainbow things, watercolor. I don't know what they're called. I did not get it personalized. But again, this is part of my organizational product, so, or not product, this is part of my organizational project. Sorry, I'm a little sick today, you guys. Um, that is gonna be to be determined as well, but these are on the website. Well, goodness, I am missing something. Hmm. In my order, I was supposed to receive a hardbound notebook in turquoise and I never received it, so that's kind of a bummer. I will have to email them and ask them where that is. So it was just a um, promotional thing, so maybe they ran out, I don't know. But again, it was already in my cart when I checked out. So I think they were only giving it to like the certain amount of people until they were like out of stock in it. So I don't know, but I'll send them an email. Erin Condren Customer Service is usually really good about those kind of things. So that is going to be it for my Erin Condren 2018 haul. If you guys are interested in getting anything from Erin Condren and it's your first time ordering, make sure to click the link down below provided. That is an affiliate link. So what happens is if you sign up using that link, you just put in some personal information, you enter your email address, 
If you decide to end up buying anything from Erin Condren, you will get a $10 off coupon code actually emailed to you previous to checking out. You apply that unique coupon code, it's just for you. You apply the $10 and then when your item ships to you, so if you buy like a Planny Pack for example, when your Planny Pack ships to you, then I get a $10 off coupon code for another purchase. So it's a really great deal for you if you have never purchased anything from Erin Condren before. If you have purchased from Erin Condren before, unfortunately you can't like double dip on it essentially, but it's great to just even try out like a sheet of stickers or like a little sticker book or something like that too if you're not 100% sure if you wanna go with a planner yet and I totally understand. Sometimes you just wanna try out like a couple of things first just to make sure you like it. Oh, I forgot to put my designer tape in here. Oopsie, maybe I'll put that right there for you. <laughs> Gotta create a good thumbnail for you guys. So anyway, that is gonna be it for me. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me for a little part of your day. I will be listing all the items down below. Again, that link, um, that's an affiliate link, will um, take you directly to the Erin Condren website if you would like to check it out. Also, I know I've said this like five million times already, but I will be doing a walkthrough of both of these planners, and I will be showing my organizational product, or product, why do I say product? Sorry, I have a cold and it's just not going well for me today. Project, my organizational project, when I actually complete it. So I will show you guys what all of that is about very, very soon on my channel. So I am gonna jet. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me for a little part of your day. It means so much. Make sure to thumbs up the video if you liked it, as well as hit the red subscribe button if it's your first time here or you're a long time lurker. I like my lurkers. That just means that you're gonna see my videos every time they pop up and I do upload every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday with new content for you guys. So thanks so much for watching. I'll see you guys later. Bye.